I'm just going to talk about how to configure THCP relay agent on Cisco iOS. Of course, I got this document from, or this overview from this link. This link. So, THCP relay agent is any host that forwards THCP packets between clients and servers. Um, relay agents are used to forward requests and replies between clients and servers when they are not in the same physical subnet. Relay agent forwarding is distinct from the normal forwarding of an IP device where IP datagrams are switched between networks somewhat transparently. By contrast, relay agents receive DHCP messages and then generate a new DHCP message to send out on another interface. The relay agent sets the gateway IP address, uh, this field, GIADDR field of the DHCP packet, and if configured, adds the relay agent information option, uh, option 82 in the packet, and the reply, oops, and the packet then forwards it to the server. The relay, the reply from the server is forwarded back to the client after removing it, after removing option 82. <clears throat> Prerequisites. The Cisco IOS server and relay agent are enabled by default. If it's disabled, use command service DHCP to enable it. Yeah. <clears throat> And of course, you can verify this just, you know, I, by going to a, by just doing show run all and DHCP. Is it here? Hold on. Service. For some reason, it's not here on this particular particular <clears throat> version that I have. So service that's weird let me just dhcp was it yes service dhcp yeah it's not here how about this one <clears throat> yeah so i guess uh, if you actually just do no DHCP service, I mean service DHCP, then you will see that in the running config. Yeah, here. So when you don't configure it, it's enabled by default, enabled by default, right? But for some reason, it's not showing up on this. When I do, it should show up. Oh, uh, service DHCP. Yeah, but you know we have verified that it's enabled by default. But just in case it's disabled, you can uh, issue this command. Yeah. 
yeah it's not here all right so continue continuing uh, the Cisco IOS DHCP relay agent will be enabled on an interface only when the <clears throat> IP helper address command is configured. This command enables the DHCP broadcast to be forwarded to the configured DHCP server. So, yeah, I have this topology here, and I have the DHCP server, and I have the... DHCP relay agent here connected to switch one and client is connected to switch one. So the configuration is actually just one command on the DHCP relay agent and it is here. So yeah, um, it's actually it's actually already configured. And so it should be here on this interface. So it's important that in this case, the default gateway is this IP address. And this is the one that you set up. This is the one that is configured on the, on the server as well, as you can see here. So that is that is important for so that the DHCP server uh, knows uh, which network the the uh, the address I mean the request is coming from, right? So so in this case, um, the DHCP server knows that the request is coming from this network because the source of the request is actually uh, 192.168.1.254 because this is this is the uh, the request is uh, is coming from the uh, relay agent in this case and this is the the source of that request all right so yeah uh, you can, I will add this, all of these in the description of this video. Uh, but as you can see here, I'm also on the, the client, which is a router. So I just, I can just uh, no shut the interface and DHCP. So that's how you actually configure the client to get a DHCP address. And while that's actually, let me just do, oh, a little too late. Yeah, it's fine. Um, let me do it again. No sh shut. And then I will just turn that, uh, I mean, issue that command, and then they say no shut, shut, and then no shut again. So the client will request an IP address again. And let's just check the, uh, the logs on the, on this router. Okay, waiting. Okay, so you can see here that I'm looking for this. So this is the this is the one that uh, is actually this statement is talking about the relay agent sets the gateway IP address. So in this case, this is that IP address, and that is the one that is configured on this interface, right? And we see that 
um, it the, the request was forwarded to this uh, IP address then that is the server right so 192.168.2.1 here and then so I'm guessing this is the and this is the uh, the the client and if you go to the client we see that it's got it now has an IP address so let's check this interface and this is the one that is yeah let's check its MAC address so the same yeah so same this is the MAC address on the interface here yeah the same so let me verify yeah it's got an IP address and from the server you can actually do this command also yeah MAC address I mean IP address and of course I've got these verification commands so from the relay you can use this command yeah so this is the um, helper IP address so basically just the server address the HTTP server address and then yeah so that's how you can configure, it's just one command really, uh, a DHCP or a router as a DHCP relay agent on Cisco iOS. Thanks for watching.